Hello everyone, welcome back to Gaming with Jeff, my name is Jeff, and today, um, we're playing something different. It's called Yi Jian. Uh, it's an auto battler, deck builder, engine building thing. Thank TFT meets Slay the Spire, switch, or meets, meets, um, like a board game engine building type thing. Combat game? I don't know. It's, it's really cool. I'm gonna show you guys. Um, yeah, we're switching modes. We're no, not casual. We're on ranked. Thank you. Um, let's go and play my first ranked game. I went through all the tutorial. I'll explain it to you guys as I go. Um, some of the translations are a little weird. Uh, I know this seems Chinese, um, but it all kind of makes sense and it seems to flow together really well. So basically, you have these cards, and you have your combat deck, and it's called your deck. And what you're going to do is you're going to place them in order, like so, and it's going to play them throughout the combat. Um, this number up here is Chi, this little blue thing. Uh, if you don't have the required Chi to play a card, you can't play the card. Uh, it also, again, it's an auto battler. So, you do upgrades. And then there's the, the cultivation part of the game that it's um, so high on, is you do upgrade into, uh, like you have five tiers of cards. So you'll see that my deck's gonna play itself against this opponent. Uh, the combat is kind of slay the spirey and there's attack armor and like debuffs and whatnot armor you lose half at the end of each of your turn so you kind of want to line up your armor with your opponents you can also see what your opponent's doing uh, I haven't unlocked any other side jobs yet uh, this gives you like another deck to add to your own deck so there's three like decks and then a bunch of characters for each deck that all have different like passives as you start um, this guy, like, I can... This is just reroll cards. And I can do the first one for free. And see, now we have four slots. I mean, you, you have to fill up slots, otherwise you pass that turn. So I'm gonna reroll Thunder Sword here. Um, probably gonna take this Fundamental Elixir. Um, one thing you can't do is they don't slide. They, like, swap, so you have to manually do it which is kind of annoying let's keep re-rolling here kind of want um that's fine i think this is almost wasted but it's just going to be the first turn it's if it says consumption it's used once during combat and that's it okay unfortunate way that lined up so we did exactly half our life on the first time so we should kill her okay cool and they lose four HP so HP is up here um, you have a hundred and it goes down based on you know what happens um i'm gonna cultivate here and you can also throw things into your character and i'm gonna break through you get a new passive and you like go into the next stage of cards um i'm just gonna take this passive here um if you did not attack this turn you get three defense so it's kind of good. So now uh, the second tier of cards are added into my pool. Uh, it's kind of whatever. Okay, that's what we wanted. Although we have to fill up the slot. So why don't we just do this? But then next time we'll, we'll cultivate here and do that. We just hit it right here. So yeah, hopefully we get this one. 
that kind of hurt. So this guy has is using like the spirit deck, which is like some five elemental deck. Uh, we might be dead. I don't know. Oh, Exaxes. We would have killed him next attack. Okay, whatever. This is fine. All right, so. Immortality, I think, is the fourth phase, and Incarnation is the last phase. So you'd get these cards, but I'd rather just have a card now. Um, we don't need more key, more uh, chi. Do we have? Well, we do if it has to rotate through. No, we don't. It's just reroll. I kind of hate that. We could do this. You can have two consumption cards up. Sword Intent is like uh, an attack buff for your next attack. Cloud hits something. Uh, we need to get something here. Um, okay, let's do this. Not amazing. <laughs> we just need something to happen. What is this? Both continuous. Uh, so continuous are like uh, powers in Slay the Spire. Both players lose 3 HP and add 3 defense at the beginning of your turn. That's seems fine for me. Oh, he's super tanky, huh? Maybe it's not fine for me. Oh, one thing that's cool, the game speeds up as you go, um, just in case. Uh, so absorb, you can throw it in here, you get the buff, so I get plus one HP. It's pretty good. Cloud hit, do I have any cloud? Oh, we have, do, we do have a cloud hit there. Uh, so if the name of the last card you use has cloud sword, it triggers its effect. So this goes, Sword Intent 2, which would buff this, uh, both these attacks for 2. That's pretty good. Uh, 16 Giant Sword Will. That's pretty, pretty hilarious. So we just upgrade that. Um, I think we're kind of just chilling here. Yeah. Yeah, this is fine. All right, this guy's got hexagram, which basically uh, changes. There's random effects in the game, but if you have hexagram stacks, it consumes one and makes it a um, hundred percent chance to activate. That's why we got weakened there. Oh, well, it's gonna be close. Oof. Oof. Let's break through again, I think. Makes sense. Uh, we get automatic cloud hits. It seems fine. Oh, three times three. Can we do this? We. I don't really care about that um exhaust sword intent I, I don't that doesn't really do anything I'll cultivate that for sure next attack ignores okay 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 let's do that we already have this maxed out Nope, don't do that. Two key, two defense, two sword intent. 
This seems pretty good. I feel like there's a spot for it somewhere. I like this for like... Removing a slot from our deck. You know, because that means we go through our uh, go through our chain faster. I like the way the characters look too. This girl sitting on like a moon thing. It'd be nice if she would not murder me. Oh, she's playing claw. Yeah, I think. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Oh. Okay, she was gonna kill me next time. It's okay. It's okay. Light sword necessity. Yep. That seems just fine. Uh, get rid of this. I'll cultivate 16 defense. Is this. Is this good? Do we just want to put this here? Two key. If Q is... If he is... If Chi, not Ki. If Chi is greater than two, I don't think that's what we want. I don't think we want that either. We definitely don't want that. Um... This is fine. Yeah, if they hit ready, um, it just goes right into it, which is kind of awesome. So you don't have to wait out the full, like, 90 seconds or however long it becomes. That, we gotta replace that. Nine attack is a joke. Why does she have 100 HP right now? What is happening? Feed on illusions. Oh my god. What is this character? Stop healing. Better eighty HP. No. No, oh, she's a boss character. Stop. Stop it. Alright, here we go. Yes. Ended with two. She ended with 230. Um, two for each key. A uh, chi. I keep saying key. I gotta stop that. 11 attack. Your opponent's chi is reduced by one. That seems good. You can also see who you're fighting and look at what they, um have lined up which is uh can be kind of relevant let's reroll that reroll this okay that's good let's do that Oh, there's another one. That seems good. That could be good, but I don't know what we're doing with it. Like, we don't have that many cloud swords. I think we just let it ride here. Maybe this should be second. Continuous. The damage of destiny for a defeated player are reduced by seven. What the hell? Destiny is your like max HP in like the actual, like not in battle in the whole round in the game. This guy's trying to kill me. The rude as hell. Well, he's dead. Um, three defense, zero attack. That's one for every attack. 
That's not bad. So this would be 8, this would be 11, then I'd add 11 attack. Oh, wait a second, wait a second. Um... Oh, wait, we want that to be, like, over here. Um, we have enough chi for everything. Let's just roll. Cloud Sword and Necessity. Uh, we already have that level up. Let's see if we can... Giant Rock Sword. Ooh, Chase is good, but we're not doing that yet. I think this is fine. It's really, it looks like it's really strong, but we'll see. It could also be bad. And it's also really strong the first turn. After that, I'm not sure, sir. Oh, so it's gonna ignore defense. So that's good. Why did I hit... Why did I hit him for four? I am slightly confused. Slightly confused here. Giant rock soul spirit. Breakthrough. When the next destiny is exhausted, keep one destiny and not be eliminated. Okay, I guess we get a... A redo if we're about to die. We need to figure out a plan here. That's not it. It's not part of the plan. Reflexive sword. So we like countered or something. And that was not... We didn't want to counter. Um... We don't have the chi for that. So, if we played Cloud Sword, Cloud Sword, this one, and then this one, we would chase with the next one. Ah. I don't know. Let's let's just do this and figure it. Let's see what happens. Let's see if this actually works this time. So we should get 16 armor. Oh, it's attack. It's not sword intent. You're just doing as much damage as you have armor. Okay. Okay, it's a different. Okay, so this doesn't really matter. I mean, it's fine, but it's like, but now it's going to do nothing. Yeah. 
Okay, I did not understand. Absorb. And one more talent cultivation, sure. Um get rid of this. Bring this down here. Combine this. Five times three. Sure. That seems good. Um do that. What if we did this? That? So that's gonna make two. Um, Reroll here. No, we don't need exorcism. Cloud sort finish. Okay, cloud hit chase. That's good. So chase makes it so you use the next attack. All right, so now we have three. Um, you take this down. Can we add this. Roll this. Um, I don't care about that too much. So this is adding three, and then kind of working. I think. I think it's gonna work. And then we heal twelve, and then we reset. Right, so we got much more DPS now. Yeah, that chases that. Which cloud hits? Three. Yes. And then he dies? Okay. Well, that seems good. These unrestrained things I don't think we need. Gladly. I will gladly gain all of that. What can we, like, replace here? Plus one defense, gain two stacks of increased attack. Continuous, add one chi every two turns. Huh. Um. I think we're just supposed to let this, let this one rock. Who are we fighting? Fighting this guy? Do I have to kill him first? I kind of want to go ahead of him. I think that matters, so let's uh, cultivate a little bit. Hopefully that was enough. It was. Thanks for the chi, my friend. Nice defense. 12 and chase. Boop, boop. I 
Ow. That didn't feel good. I think we got him. Defeat Inner Demon. Just killed a man. Flow Cloud Chaos Sword. Two attacks times four. Could be four times four. This one's weird. Um, I think what we want to do is do this, and then do, like, this, and then Breakthrough. Um, I would like, yeah, I would like the Spring Teeth. Spring Course Tea, thank you. That's not it. Moon Water Sword. Okay, that's, like, Barricade. Kind of. You get 10 defense and it doesn't decrease, but we don't really do a lot of defending. Flying Spirit Sage Sh Sh Shade Sword. One attack times four. Add one key for every attack that injured the opponent. Do we just... Like this? But then... Long enough for this, but maybe that's fine. Maybe we do this instead? Maybe. I don't know. Um, let's find out. Let's find out if that works. We may have broken our abilities here. I don't know. All right, he activated his wood spirit, so you know that's something to watch out for. Can we do better here? That that beginning is like not inspired. Add two attack for each chi. That's pretty good. Ice spirit gains two sacks of guard up. You can resist one HP reduce. That's kind of neat. Okay. What do we do? What do we do? What if we just, like, move this down here? And this just, like, increases our attack by two. If that increases our attack by two, doesn't that increase, like, this to 16? Right? Am I crazy for thinking that? This should work. Okay, let's... Uh, well, we're about to find out, I guess. So... Attack 2. Does this expire, or is it just plus 2? It's plus 2 power? Okay, so it's plus 2 power, just like... Um, 
That was pretty good. Uh, just like say inspire. Good, 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 good. So we're on a multi-hit build. I guess that's that's what's happening. This is the insane HP person. Not gonna be good enough. We're gonna outscale her by a lot. Oh what? Oh that's not enough. Here the Biakia build. Exhaust. Chi. I, I would really rather just draw a card. I don't none of those things really matter. Okay, yep, that's That's good. Absorb, increase okay. Increase to max max HP, that seems good. These things don't matter to by four. Two by five, that's a lot. Unrestrained sword zero. Well, that's kind of neat. Um. I feel like there's got to be a spot for this. So this is like the key to our build is to increase attack. Five attack. Add two attack. So, okay, so it's an increase attack is permanent, add attack is like one time. So divine power elixir is kind of good, but it's only like one time. Uh, let's just cultivate those. Move on to the next phase. Um, yeah, I think this will be fine. Okay, so we hit for 10. We he adds some chi. We hit him for a bunch. Please stop hurting me. Next attack ignores defense. So that's almost all your life. Unable to. Unable. What? Unable to eat. Unable to act. Oh, it's he stunned me. Jeez, he almost got maybe this is bad. Maybe the recovery elixir is not good because like we just go through our motions anyway. Retrigger the previous sword formation card in the deck. Um I want to see sword formation. Whenever you use Cloud Sword, add 2 HP. It's okay, but I think we're kind of like... We're kind of in for all DPS right now. Which means we should probably get rid of this. Probably should add this. Let's move all these over. Because we automatically have cloud hit. Chase makes us jump through this a little bit faster. Yeah, this just makes sense. Let's just run with this. I think we're doing okay. I mean, we're, we're currently winning. Increase attack. As long as we don't get, like, increased attack... Or, or some type of like cleanse on us, I think we're okay. All 
All right. That was a that, uh, that was decent. And we chase, and then he's dead. Not quite. He's dead on the next cycle for sure. Okay, well he got hit. He hit me for eight, so that's not uh, not a strong showing for him. Healing elixir, you can just get right out of here. Bodybuilding elixir, on the other hand, I will take. Raven spirit sword, no. No, uh, I will upgrade that. That seems really good. Absorb three destiny. Okay, I got three HP back. Looking for multiples. Upgrade. One level one card in your hand or deck randomly. Oof. Um, you know what? Let's just roll the dice. Oh, wow. Um, yeah, that's fine. That's, that's, I'm totally okay with that. What, what are they doing? You know what? I don't even care what they're doing. Let's go. Time to win. We are so much more cultured than them. Look at this, 75 versus 66, what are you even doing? Yeah, everything was looking good till you got hit by a thousand swords. He says as he stabs me. And stuns me. And then dies. Is that it? Is he dead? Minus 27. I think he's still alive. He's got two left. Acceptable. Nope. Don't need any of these. That's pretty good. 10 attack, 10 defense, chase. Well, damn. That's pretty good. What are we doing with it, though? Like, where is it? Is it here? The only problem is if this gets blocked, we're in, like, big trouble. The spirit sword card key cost is decreased by one. Okay, I don't know what exactly the spirit sword is, but Senti Bird Spirit Sword Formation. That is a clear translation error. <laughs> um, is five times three better than two times five? When we have three attacks, this is five times five, and that's gonna be five times six. That's still better. The first time around. Also, it doesn't cost anything. Um, I'm just looking to see if there's anything we can do to make it this better. I don't think so. I think we're kind of just locked in. We won last time. I'll we'll see why I change anything. Make him fix it. I mean, he's giving us chi, so maybe we could play it out of the card. Oh, he's just dead. He stuns us and he hits us again, but then he just dies. And we win. We're the greatest. The greatest to play the game. The greatest to ever do it. Plus 99. Foundation. Foundation. I am champion. I am greatest. Rank two. 
Battle experience. Money. We got money. So, yeah, that's Yixian, um... The Cultivation Card Game. Exit the room. I will exit the room. Um, so the things you can do, you can, with the money you get, you can purchase these characters. They don't come unlocked. Um, you see the different, uh, decks that you get to use, basically. And then, besides that, there's the, uh, I don't know, Fate. There's... I don't even know where it is. No, these are the decks. And they're just the side jobs. This is what you pick. So I only have Elixirist, but you can get Flutist. And these will all get thrown into your pool of cards whenever you decide what to pick. So there's a lot of variation stuff. And then there's these things, which I have no idea what they are. Um, like additional stuff, I guess, as you go. But yeah, um... You might see a couple bad reviews on this game because of the immoral market. I, I, I know it says immoral, but... Um, you can purchase these monies that you earn during the game. I don't think it really matters. There's nothing I've seen you can buy that you can't buy for, like, within the game stuff, but... You know, oh, I guess this is the only thing. Is costumes. I'm not going to complain too much about that saying but be aware that that is in the game and that's why steam hasn't like totally picked up on this game yet but anyway yeah that's easy cultivation deck builder if you like um our stone battlegrounds uh story time brawl tft slay the spire or anything like that definitely check it out it's a lot of fun i'm enjoying it um i'm probably gonna play more and I'll see y'all next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share this video with your friends or anyone else who might be interested in the game. Thanks for watching. Later.